Because guess what? He was the same when the first child was born, when the second child was born. He was the same when the third. And you knew this. You laid with him every night. You had kids to secure a bag. And she did, but not the bag she wanted. So in her defense, though, right? We're not going to play dumb to facts. But and <laughs> even when Shay was pregnant with her boyfriend's child, my son was treated so bad in that house because she had an insecurity that that baby was his. Bambi thought Shay's baby was mm -hmm. Scrappy's. Mm -hmm. I know you lying about this degree because you came in the door with lying. About. She lied about her age first. How old is she? I have proof what that age is. What proof do you have? Um, if you could read that for me. Could you read that, Carlos? What is this, Mama D? Could you read that? Get your glasses, dear. What is this, child? This is a birth certificate. Show this it on my life. This is Bambi's birth certificate. Yes. Please, please. I don't have any time for any gossip now. Eh? Yeah? Yes. Hey guys, before we get into this video, I do need you to go ahead and subscribe to my channel and make sure you guys enable your bell notification so you do not miss out on a video. Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. And if you are new to my channel or if you're returning, I want to welcome you guys back. So guys, we are going to get into this video um, and also, I want to send a shout out and thank Roses Blossom 333 for sending me the message because I was totally out of my element today. Um, but I had the opportunity to watch this interview. Um, so I wanted to shout her out and give her um, the letter know thank you because I was totally on something else today. But like I stated, I did have the opportunity to sit down and watch Mama D's interview with Carlos King, guys. And I even had to rewind it a few times. And I have to say, I have a new respect for Mama D. Now, I'm not saying that she's not crazy, but I can definitely say I understand her a lot better. She gave a lot of um, explanations for her behavior. Not saying that she's correct, but she understands that she's not right in what she does. But what she has stated is she is going to parent just as she knows how, and that's okay. But one of the things I really wanted to speak about is some of the things she got into with regards to Bambi, y'all. And I know y'all gonna say, Mama D hates Bambi. You know, that may be true, but some of the things that she said about Bambi was so disturbing that I am actually gonna be doing some more research on some of those things. But what I want to do is get into some specific things that she had to say about Bambi. And she dropped some very interesting receipts. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to play that video snippet. And y'all know how we do it. We're going to come back and talk about it. So let me get this video up and we'll come back and talk. About it. Straight toward the juggle for money. She, she said, I want 10000 for what? For a child support, alimony, all that. That's what she wants a month. A month or mm -hmm. just a month? But Dow just got into it, and he just left the house and went yeah. to the hotel. And this, no divorce was filed yet. None of that was even in the picture. She but that's 10, the first thing, yes. A month or just that one-time fee? A month. So if, you're, if your anger is directed toward money and not on love, why is it on the pocket? Why would you, with him being the way you tell the world he is, why would you continue to have children? Because guess what? He was the same when the first child was born. <laughs> he was the same when the second child was born. He was the same when the third. And you knew this. You laid with him every night. You know this, man. So, so you had kids to substantiate a bad girl. Because, you know, in L.A., had they been in L.A., you know, the the, the divorce rules are different. She could have gotten for everything. Oh, in L.A., but, in mm -hmm. Calif California so, law, yeah, yeah, yeah. 50-50. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. So you wouldn't have these kids because somebody in your ear, girl, you better have it. You better have them kids, honey, because as long as they I don't care if y'all break up, you'll at least have some money. So that's why she kept having them back to back, not out of love. 
it was to secure a bag. And she did, but not the bag she wanted. And that's why the anger and bitterness, you see all that coming out because she didn't get what she asked for in court and she's miserable. And when she tells people, because I know she's going to see this interview, no. my family's from, we're not on that level. We weren't raised in the hood. I didn't come from the hood. I lived in it. As I made wrong decisions in life, I found myself in the hood doing hood things, mm -hmm. but I wasn't raised. She was raised in the hood and with nothing because she comes from nothing. So, you know, it is what it is. Now, Mama D, in her interview with Carlos King, is saying that Bambi pretty much got with Scrappy just to be on Love & Hip Hop. Now, we have heard this story before. In fact, not that long ago, because I just recently did a video where Benzino came out and he said that he and Bambi, they were actually dating. Um, and this is what Benzino stated. Um, it wasn't like he had just met Bambi and they were in the hot tub. They were actually dating. And if you guys don't believe me, you can go and watch the um, live that him and Mama D did. And also, if you go and watch the interview that Little Scrappy gave with Carlos King, um, Little Scrappy said that when he saw Bambi in the hot tub with Benzino, they were pretty much dating. So what Scrappy did know is that Bambi was truly in a relationship with Benzino. But what Benzino stated is that Bambi used him to get to Scrappy. So it's very interesting that people are saying very similar stories. And I don't know what their motivation would be for just making up these stories. See, the main T when, we, when I got in the room and what I seen, the only reason I'm doing this is because I felt like Bambi used me from the start. Yeah. Oh. Bambi, and, and let me tell you why. And let me tell you why. Mm -hmm. Bit. Bambi wanted to make Scrappy jealous when she was dating me. And, and my didn't know that. So he was with somebody else, right? I don't know who he was with, but I know I now, I I know now that Bambi was just dating to get on the show to get with Scrappy. Now, that's why I've been trying to tell people. Right. That's 100%. That's why I've been trying to tell you. That now, 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 I always felt like once I knew that, I still was being a gentleman, still didn't like. And thank you for and, respecting and, my and son still never, was mad. Right, thank and you. still never disrespected or even like yeah. was mad. I just took it like a man, yeah. you know what I'm saying? And, yeah. and, and, and moved on, you know what I'm saying? Scrap's a little taller than me, you know what I'm saying? It, it, it's a better fit, you know, at, at that at that time. Yeah. When 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 Bambi was going through this, when they brought up the, the, the hot tub scene on Love and Hip Hop this past season, yeah. I'm like, damn, this was a long time ago. And I'm like, why are they doing this? Bambi sat up in there when they was giving her, her slack because her and Rashida were friends, and they're like, damn, did you set up Kirk for, for them? She gonna say, well, I know y'all don't like the way Benzino look, but he was cool with me. He was kind of, oh, he was always, he was always kind of like the homie or something. I'm like, you try to throw a shot at me even still. Mm -hmm. See, Bambi is calculated and yeah, tries she to, she she tries to throw Landon. shots. Mm -hmm. You know, like honestly, I'm she, telling you, and she, and she plays innocent. Yeah. All right. So I want, that's the only reason I'm doing this. I'm now. trying to tell y'all. All right. That's true. When Mama she was, was right. going back and forth with my granddaughter, Iman, y'all. She's too slick. It. She's too slick she with real it. Real slick. She's too slick. But with I'm it. slicker, and Scrappy didn't warn her about me because if she did, she would have been shut the hell up long time. And that's ago. why, and that's why her messing with Rashida trying to be. Well, guys, in the previous video clip that I just put on the screen, you heard Benzino pretty much saying the same thing about Bambi using Scrappy to pretty much be on the show. Um, Mama D said the same thing. So I want to know what you guys think. Have you had the opportunity to watch the interview with Mama D and Carlos King? Mama D went in detail. Not only did she say Bambi used Scrappy, she stated that Bambi had child after child to secure her a child support check. And although Bambi may have came up just a little bit, she didn't nearly get the 10000 that she was requesting from a judge. 
So y'all know how this goes. Let's have a conversation in the comments. Let me know what you think. Have you had the opportunity to actually watch the full video? Let me know what y'all think in the comments. Please make sure that you are subscribed to the channel and also enable your bell notification so you do not miss out on a video.